I'm going to talk a little bit about the, the final tier 4 700. So it wasn't just an update. We released it just about a year ago. It was in March last year. And uh, beyond the update of the engine, we, we added some new features to the machine. We improved the hydraulic system, the electric over hydraulic valve. We increased the horsepower from 125 to 130 horsepower. We have a new eco mode. This particular machine, the 700, is a uh, 700 LGP. Weighs about 30,000 pounds, maybe 31,000 pounds, depending on how it's configured. This one here has a 144 inch blade. That is a new option for the 700 as well. Uh, we have auto idle, auto shutdown on this machine. So we're looking for fuel savings, looking for uptime. Yeah, in our 700K, we have built into the joystick, we've got increment or decrement. So what increment or decrement means is uh, above or below that target grade. So we can, we can raise or lower the whole surface to which the machine is gonna grade to. So in our crawler, it's built into the joystick. So when we're in reverse and we're looking out the window to make sure that we're safely backing, we can decrement down or raise or lower the grade to get to subgrade for paving or get to uh, you know the top of rock. And the other solution, um, they have they have to go into the monitor, such as that's on the screen. If you see, um, I would click on the lower left and then use uh, elevation set point, and they'd have to go in here. It's very tough to do when we're in reverse, right? It's it's kind of a safety issue, and safety is very important today. So by integrating that into the joystick, we're able to multifunction as we're as we're backing. And in the industry today, uh, many contractors uh, the grates. You know, there's different sectional depths, right? Maybe the paving's a foot thick over here, but on this side of the parking lot, we're laying four inches of asphalt. So we're going to constantly be adjusting this. So this is a big advantage to our 700K.